work with layers that I hadn't seen before in, in a lot of visual art that I've looked at before. And yeah, it was just lovely that he donated this piece. And it's great to see so many people here. Uh, yeah, just some general comments and reaction and yeah. Well, my, my opportunity to meet Issa was just very recently and first of all my sense was what a gentle soul and what a creative man and what a man that cares about the rest of mankind. And so as he took me around the room to look at some of his pieces that he was putting on the walls, he made it clear to me that you're to feel comfortable touching them because they're very tactile and I have enough sight that I can see the vibrant colors. And so it became art that was available to those of us that have little sight but some. And so I thought, what a perfect fit. But he, his generosity. I, I, I guess I, one of the first things I said to him was, I'm always curious about why folks choose Winnipeg. I'm a great Winnipegger, love Winnipeg. I'm a true cheerleader for the, for the city. And then he began to describe to me why. And it became clear that because they embraced him, he recognized the need to give back to them. And to choose CNIB as one of its many recipients, I just, as an organization, as a client, and as the chairman of the board, I felt truly honored and really touched. I, I tend to wear my heart on my sleeve, and as does he, because he often would describe to me the piece that he was showing me and how it was conceived and what it meant, and that even putting it up with a price tag on was a real difficult thing for him to do. He, in fact, said on more than one occasion, which is probably typical of artists, it would be like choosing a child to sell. But at some time, at some point in time, he said, I have to be somewhat pragmatic and pick one of my children, which, of course, in his case, translates to his art. So we could not have been happier to host this and for him to be committed to giving us some of the proceeds of his amazing creativity is immeasurable. It's something to give us a monetary gift or to buy something or to fund a particular initiative in CNIB, but to actually give us some of the proceeds of what came from his soul is really quite unique. So we're delighted. Thanks, sweetie. In fact, he can't pay attention to you because he's working. Okay. I just love his work. I just love all of the paintings, some more than others, of course. And I love the orange, and the brightness, and the color. Um, some of it, I'm not quite sure if I understand, but I sure appreciate it. And even the, the other colors that aren't the orange and gold, these greens are gorgeous whenever he gets it, or even the blues. So all I know is what I like. <laughs>